A special hello to all my fellow Poltergeist detectives and Tim Burton fans. Welcome or welcome back to McFly, my little corner on the internet where I just sit here and yap on about gaming and stuff. I'll be your host, eating breakfast, and it is finally that time. The juice is loose, or at least in another week. But regardless, we do have a gameplay reveal trailer which we're going to check out. Fully introducing the juice and all his hijinks, and I am a little disappointed it's not Michael Keaton's voice. <laughs> Showtime! But I do understand that would probably be difficult to lock down. But that's besides the point. Like I said, we have a gameplay trailer to look at. We have a release date, technically, an event coming up, and then even a question to the audience. Do you think Beetlejuice is going to be overpowered upon release? I hate to be a pessimist, but I have a feeling. <laughs> but without further ado, let's summon the poltergeist detective himself, and let's see what he's got. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. You say my name? No. Was it you? This won't end well, I'm afraid. Uh, who said my name? Who Those said eyes. it? Uh, can I tell you a secret? Uh. Really? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Showtime. I think an assassin, okay. together in front of Wonder Woman. She seemed like my kind of good girl. That is gonna buy a new suit. All the other. <laughs> a buggity, buggity, buggity. Come on down for a wheel of pain. Like what? Let's turn on the juice and see what shakes loose. No, 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 no. Where's your sign? Oh. oh, that's interesting. Yeah, mojo. There's only room for one 80s classic here. Come right. on! One little snacky after midnight. Yeah. <laughs> That's one more thing to say. All the voice lines and all the... Whoever writes the voice lines for this game, just gold star, man. All right, but that's it. That's short and sweet. We can expect him next week with the new event on August 20th. We'll probably be doing the similar thing that we've been doing now with events, just getting a new skin and then grinding out the XP towards the event. And possibly earning Beetlejuice in the process? I'm I'm still not too sure how that's going to fully work out. But then there's something to be said about the new currency that's coming with it, about these green beetles. But I guess we'll find out more about that next week. I will say I was expecting more. With what they've been doing, I should have expected this kind of trailer. But I really expected like someone actually showing off some combos. I'm sure there were some in the video, but I mean actually showing it off. Granted, they do have special live streams. I guess I have to pay attention to those to see the actual like layout of Beetlejuice. But regardless, it's still really cool to see the constant flow of characters, whether they be OP or not. I guess they'll get balanced eventually. And like I said before, I'm kind of sad that it's not Michael Keaton. I mean, I'm not even a huge fan of the Beetlejuice films, but he'll always be Beetlejuice to me, obviously. But I understand how that's kind of hard to lock down with rights and God knows how expensive that would be, right? And then after that, we did get a look at some of the event skins for our characters. But if you guys want to check out more of that, there is a data mine video on my channel. And then we get a flash at his skins, which we already know his original look. We obviously get that, which great model. I love the pot belly. It's really nice. The only thing I probably would change is I wish his hair was a little bit more puke color because he does give me Joker vibes. They are very similar, but I don't think you can really help that. They're just similar looking characters, I guess. The fun part will be that they're differentiated from their moves because I did not expect Beetlejuice to be an assassin, which means he's probably really light and then also will hit like a truck. And then the one that threw me off was it goes from his circuit drone skin to like a traditional manador. Like what? What about Beetlejuice as a manador? <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I just thought it was an odd choice, but still funny to see. What else can I say? Yeah, like the voice lines, I can't praise that enough. Whoever writes the voice lines for any of these characters, especially Samurai Jack with his past release, he's got a lot of cool lines. Oh, and then a little sneak peek. We did see the Mojo Jojo fight, which seems to be an upcoming Rift event. I don't exactly know the full in and out of it, but eventually we're going to fight Mojo as a boss in Rifts, and there's speculation that it's going to lead to a Powerpuff Girls reveal. There has been plenty of breadcrumbs. Hopefully they're coming with Season 3, right? But that's probably for another video. All in all, I think this could be really cool for the game, obviously. It's nice to see a constant flow of characters. My only hopes could be that they would balance them better before release, but I guess that has to go with the flow of interest. I don't know. I really don't know how it goes with this. But that's really all I got for this one. It was nice to see the sneak peek of Beetlejuice. The juice will be loose next week. We can finally hop in, or we might have to grind for him first. But at least maybe we can use him in the lab and try him out. And like I said before, I'm not the biggest fan about the Beetlejuice movies. I just never really got into them. How about you? You're going to go see the second film? It would be some kind of funny irony if I really enjoyed playing the character, but I've never really seen the movies. <laughs> but time will tell. 
Thank you guys so much for watching, especially if you made it this far. A like is always appreciated, all that good YouTube stuff. I'm going to get out of here, and I will catch you out there in the multiverses. Mm -hmm.